At this site, only visible from the skies, scientists use the world's largest titanium sapphire crystal to bend light waves, concentrating them into a single fiercely powerful laser beam. It's hard to comprehend how much energy is being emitted by these lasers. These are at 10 petawatts. That's 10 billion watts. That's roughly equivalent to one-tenth of the energy coming out of the sun. 120,000 tons of reinforced concrete protect 21,500 square feet of machine to produce a beam finer than a human hair. These lasers are so powerful that you have to have a specially constructed facility to house them. The density of energy produced is only found in exploding stars. It's unimaginable that human beings have created this. In 2019, after three years of testing, the laser developed here, the most powerful in history, reaches operational phase. We're all probably familiar with the Death Star creating a beam of energy that will destroy a planet. Well, this isn't too far off. Luckily, this laser can only be active for fractions of a second at a time. Powerful lasers can be used for many things, but one of the things that's on the cutting edge right now is their use in destroying cancer. In short pulses, these large bursts of energy can obliterate cancer cells. This intense light burst is even capable of altering the state of atoms, rendering highly radioactive materials safe. Lasers this powerful could be used in disposing of nuclear waste, but also in answering questions about the nature of the universe. According to quantum physics, the vacuum of space is made up of bonded pairs of matter and antimatter. Scientists here may be able to use the energy from this laser to smash the bond, magically creating something out of nothing. The race is on to develop more and more powerful lasers, so powerful they could rip apart space. These people are diving into the unknown. 